Hello everyone, uh, welcome again to our channel Adobong Briton. Ito po si Nurse Haji and uh, I want to share to you one of the renal replacement therapy that we use. Obviously, we've got the peritoneal dialysis, hemodialysis, and renal transplantation. I want to share to you about peritoneal dialysis. So what is peritoneal dialysis? Peritoneal dialysis is a method where the blood is cleaned inside the body through the peritoneum. Uh, this is the thin membrane that surrounds the outside of the organs, stomach, liver, and bowels in the abdomen, and this area is called abdominal cavity. The peritoneum allows the waste product to pass through it and is very rich in small blood vessels. The abdominal cavity serves as a reservoir for the cleaning solution, which is changed regularly. By filling the abdominal cavity with cleaning solution via a tube or a catheter, the solution then removes waste product from the blood through the peritoneum. So here we go guys, I will show you a sample of the uh, peritoneal catheter. So as you can see guys, this is the example of the uh, peritoneal catheter okay so a tube is inserted in there into the peritoneal cavity and you've got the catheter outside okay so this is where we attach the um, solution okay so there's a cup at the end this is where we attach the solution okay and uh, fill the peritoneal cavity with that solution What does the bag exchange consist of? Okay, so you, there's three things in the bag exchange. One is the fill. Okay, so basically we fill the uh, peritoneal cavity with the solution. Okay, number two is the dwell. Dwell is where we keep the solution inside the peritoneum for a certain amount of time. And then the drain. Number three is the drain. Okay, that's where we take the solution out so what does the tube look inside okay we've got a sample catheter here all right so basically this is how the tube looks inside as you can see here right the tube has multiple holes okay where we can drain the um, the solution okay we can drain in and we can drain out the solution and a hollow tube there as well at the end okay so basically a catheter sits inside the peritoneum and then that's how it looks like so we put the solution inside solution drains through this catheter okay uh, normally depends of depends on the size of the patient uh, normally we'll put between 1200 to 2000 or 2500 mils of solution inside the peritoneum okay so that is your fill volume and normally it sits in there for four to six hours solution um, and after that after four to six hours we then drain it out again okay so normally the procedure for peritoneal dialysis um, uh, takes about four times a day so it's easier to remember uh, maybe during meal times you know uh, breakfast lunch and dinner and one at night time before you go to bed also, you've got different types of uh, connection. Uh, I believe this one is a Baxter connection. All right, so that's, that's how it looks like. 
right? That's where we connect the solution and there's an opening valve in here as well. Okay, so you can open that and close, open and close. You just twist it to open, twist to close. Okay, and and the other connection is a Fresenius line. Okay, so it all works the same. Uh, it's just uh, you know, it just vary depending on you know who supplies the solution and uh, what solution we use. Okay, so the difference is this one. Okay, so that's that. Okay, so two different lines, both works the same. So same with the uh, principles of uh, hemodialysis and peritoneal dialysis. Okay, so there are two uh, principles behind it. One is the diffusion, which is the removal of uh, uremic toxins by a concentration gradient, which means uh, the movement of solute between a higher concentration to a lower concentration. So in this case, uh, the blood has got higher toxin and then uh, diffuse from a higher concentration to a lesser concentration which is the solution that we give uh, uh, through the peritoneum and uh, the other principle behind it is osmosis which is the removal of uh, water so this is uh, in other medical terms called ultra filtration okay so there you go guys, uh, hopefully uh, I have shared something uh, valuable, especially to our medical colleagues, you know, nursing colleagues and uh, for patients as well who want to understand more about uh, peritoneal dialysis. So there you go guys, uh, hopefully you enjoyed the video. Um, if you're new to my channel, don't forget to uh, hit the like button and subscribe down below for more videos like this uh, about kidneys and other stuff uh, around UK okay so I'll see you later I better return this chap you know where he belongs see you later bye